the French Alps near the Italian border at an altitude of around 2,000 meters. Here, amid this beautiful scenery surrounded by mountains that reach for the sky, we find the typical mountain village of Bramont. This alpine fairyland is not only an ideal habitat for goats and sheep, Most tourists are attracted here by the challenge of conquering steep slopes and mountain peaks. For Deuter gland drilling, however, the challenge lies beneath all the natural beauty of this area. A rail tunnel is due to come on service below these mighty mountains by the year 2015. This will cut the distance considerably to connect Lyon via Chambry with Susa and Turin. A tunnel in part more than a thousand meters below the mountain peaks. This planned rail tunnel project will have a length of some 52 kilometers. By comparison, the channel tunnel between Calais and Dover has a length of only 42 kilometers. Research boreholes need to be drilled before major work can begin to ensure the safe construction of this enormous tunnel. Since June 1999, Deutag land drilling has drilled numerous such boreholes. Extracted data indicates the exact makeup and condition of the rock. It'll also provide an accurate map of the geology of the Alps. This will enable tunnel planners to localize potential problem zones and incorporate this data into their design. Technical challenges and innovations. Due to Deutag land drilling's international experience and special innovative deep well drilling equipment for gas and petroleum bores, the company was awarded the contract as main contractor to conduct these exploratory bores. Deutag land drilling is responsible for the overall management of the project. This means planning and execution of the drilling, developing technologies that will enable drilling under these extreme conditions, constructing the drilling site and providing facilities such as water supply and communications, etc. Providing transportation to and from the location procuring all materials such as special drill bits and tubing, also fuel and telephone lines. Integrating subcontractors to carry out directional drilling, mud and cementing services. Managing site logistics for personnel and equipment to and from the location, as well as the many other things required to complete a turnkey project. Before actually transporting drilling equipment to the location, 200 tons of gravel and 63 cubic meters of concrete had to be hauled into the mountains under off-road conditions. Bridges had to be reinforced in order to reach the drilling site at Vallon de Tache. After a total of 800 tons of drilling equipment had been installed, a start was made using a symmetric system air percussion drilling tool which hammered the first 76 meters of casing into the extremely hard underground. For this project, the Deutag land drilling rig T15 was upgraded with some new high-tech features. These include a special very strong rapid rotation top drive, as well as an automatic driller, which can automatically adjust the rate of penetration parameters. An innovative coring system was used on this rig so that a 1,000 meter horizontal section could be cored through the extremely hard alpine rock. This horizontal section shall trace the proposed tunnel axis and its tolerance of 25 meters on either side must not be exceeded. This trajectory drawing shows the planned path as opposed to the actual path of the borehole. A total of 3,000 meters will be drilled from east to west, a tremendous challenge in terms of directional drilling. Plant well pass, the red well pass, and the archived well pass on the blue line. The future work will be now to drill. In the this area of the Alps consists mainly of massive quartzite formations, extremely hard and abrasive. This called for the use of special directional drilling equipment with hardened bits and special coring bits. The coring bits used here feature an impregnated matrix studded with natural diamonds. The coring bit is mounted on the coring assembly. Installed within the coring assembly is an inner pipe with a latch-on mechanism. This makes it possible to pull the inner pipe containing the core up through the assembly once a cable has been latched on. This is known as continuous wire line coring. 
To guarantee error-free core recovery, a plastic liner sleeve is installed inside the inner pipe. During the cord drilling process, the cord formation gradually slides into the liner. Then, when the cord formation has been pulled to the surface, it can be recovered intact within the plastic liner. The core samples are then handed over to Alpetuno, the client, for geological analysis. A systems partner with a worldwide clientele, Deuter Gland Drilling is dedicated and committed to new technology and a team approach with its clients to reduce project time and operating costs. Deutag, our sights are set on becoming international market leader.